They took up a collection and asked me to give this to you if you would not try to play that song again. Nice. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Face the Music. <laughs> right now, <laughs> right now, that's okay, fellas. I did, I've been taking piano. I'll help out over there. Right now, I'd like you to meet our champion, Glad Thompson, a bookkeeper from New Rochelle, New York. Glad, welcome back. He has uh, accumulated seven thousand dollars in prizes, and of course, he's still going strong because tonight she'll once again play for possibly win ten thousand dollars in cash in our championship game. And her opponent going to be one of these three people. So let's meet the challengers now. Donna, David, Chris, starting with Donna on the end here. Hi, Hi Donna. Ron. I'm Donna Anderson, and I'm originally from Warrenville, Illinois, presently living in Phoenix, Arizona. I'm a communications interconnect opera, um, secretary. I have three children, and today, today of all days, is my daughter's fourth birthday. Terrific. So I'm so glad to be here. Hi, Dana. <laughs> We're very happy to have you here. Thank you. Hi, Dana. Donald. Hello, David. Hi, Ron. I'm Dave Swanson. I'm originally from Muncie, Indiana. I'm an ex-Marine. I've been out here in California for eight years. Presently living in Huntington Beach. I'm going to move to Eugene, Oregon very soon, though, and I'm, I'm, I'm a real estate salesman. Oh, it's nice to have you with us. Very glad to be here. You going to sell real estate in uh, Eugene, Oregon? Yes. Good. Stand by, Eugene, Oregon. Here comes super salesman David Swanson. Hi, Chris. Hi. I'm Chris Price. I'm originally from Ogden, Utah, now living in Phoenix. And I'm a retired English teacher who could never spell a word of any kind. And I'm happily married with three terrific kids. You really couldn't spell? Oh, I couldn't spell seat? anything. It was horrible. Hmm. Spelled horrible. Uh, I know. I said there was a R's or A, I'm not sure. I think there are two H's in it. I'm not sure. <laughs> Chris, welcome. Nice to have you here. First game. We're going to show you a series of pictures, play songs related to them. Each time you put the right piece of music to the right picture, you're going to score uh, 10 points, actually. Let's see the pictures now, please. Music, please. Tommy Oliver. <laughs> enough, enough. <laughs> Donna, what have you got? Sing, sing a song. Sing is right. Looking for? Bing Crosby. The Bingles. Bing Crosby, you got it. I did! Ten points for you, Donna. First one to score. Here's Tommy. Next clue. Charlie, my boy. Oh, Charlie, my boy. Donna, you've done it again. What have you got? Johnny, my boy. Oh, that's too bad. Ch Charlie, my boy. We were looking for Charles Bronson. Donna, you'll be out of the next musical clue, but keep your eyes open, because we're going to show you those pictures one last time. Roll them, please. <laughs> Music, please, Tommy. I got it. Okay. How much is that doggy in the window? And it's Benji. <laughs> that that doggy in the window and it's boomer oh <laughs> music please tommy donna what have you got the bunny hop you're right bunny hop looking for i don't remember the pictures i uh candace bergen but we're looking for hugh hefner Oh, is the that bunny who hopper that was? of all time. <laughs> Music, please, Tommy. Got it. What do you got, David? It's candy. You're looking for Candace Bergen. It's candy, and you're right. We're looking for Candace Bergen. <laughs> you got ten points there, David. <laughs> and here's your final clue. What do we got, Chris? Let's go fly kite, Ben Franklin. Let's go fly. Oh, I'm Ryan so Benjamin glad. Franklin. Well, we're so happy for you. Oh, yes. Looking at the scores as the game ends, I see we have a tie, so we will carry that tie over into our very next game with all three contestants right after this. It's the music with Ron Ely. John Harlan and Tom.
Tommy Oliver and Lisa Donovan. Welcome back. Game number two, Face the Music. Donna, David, Chris, we got a tie here, but only two of you are going to continue beyond this game, and that's the two with the highest score. Each correct answer is going to be worth 20 points to you now, contestants. And each song you hear is going to be a clue to a puzzle. First puzzle, we're looking for a famous person. Remember, always past or present on these. Music, please. Tommy Oliver. I got it. I got it. Yes, you oh, got it, Chris. Boy. Take yeah. me out to the ball game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that light surprised you, didn't it? Yeah, yeah take me out to the ball game. Joe DiMaggio. That's a good guess, I but it's so. a wrong. Yeah, I know you thought it, but it's a wrong answer. <laughs> Next clue, Tommy. I got it. Yeah, yeah, you got it again. <laughs> yeah, this is the only person I ever met that's sort of startled by their own podium. <laughs> what is the title of it, Chris? I left my heart in San Francisco. That's right. You've heard Take Me Out to the Ball Game. I left my heart in San Francisco. We'll see how well you know baseball right now. Famous person? Reggie Jackson. <laughs> we found out in a hurry, didn't we, folks? <laughs> Lisa, music. Say hey, kid. Did it again. I got it. Say hey, kid. You're looking for Willie Mays. Take me out to the ball game. I'll catch up with you in a minute, David. Take me out to the ball game. I left my heart in San Francisco. Say hey, kid. David Swanson says it's Willie Mays. I agree with him. It's the say hey, kid himself, Willie Mays. So you take the lead there, David. Donald, Chris, remember, the second is good around here. Famous state. Famous state. First clue, Tommy. By the sea, by the sea, by the beautiful sea. Except you have to have a state. By the sea, by the sea. Ah, 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 blah, 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 Maryland. <laughs> no, that's not the correct title of the song. It, yes, it isn't. Yes, I'm teasing. I was teasing. Oh. By the beautiful sea is right, and it's not Maryland. What sea is Maryland? By there. I don't think it's by the sea. The Atlantic Ocean. Oh. Yeah. By the beautiful sea, famous state. <laughs> Here's Lisa with your next song. A little red hen found a grain of wheat. So this looks... Donna, what have you got? A little red head. Oh, <laughs> a little red hen. Yeah, little red hen by the beautiful sea. Rhode Island. Rhode Island! Rhode Island, you're right. <laughs> so we were actually talking about an ocean all the time, weren't we? Donna, you've got 20 more points there. Chris? You're in third place. Familiar object. First clue, Tommy. Oh, I got it! Yes, you do, Chris. The what have you The sound got? of music. Yeah, it is the sound of music, <laughs> in spite of who played it. The sound of music, familiar <laughs> object. A nunnery. <laughs> That's where we'll send them. <laughs> We've been looking for some place to take our band for a long time, and that's it. However, that's not what we're looking for. Familiar object, the sound of music, next clue. Tommy? Donna, what have you got? That right, fling, spling up, <laughs> fling, spling down. I can't think of it now. <laughs> yes. Black and white. Black and white. Before that, the sound of music. Donna, you'll be out of the next musical clue. Familiar object contestants, here's Tommy and that band. That was actually Michelle Rubini playing Handful of Keys there for you. The Sound of Music, Black and White, Handful of Keys, Familiar Object. Next clue, Tommy. No, it's not. Oh, it is a piano. Oh, yes, you're right. It is a piano. <laughs> and we have a three-way tie. That means, that means, Donna, David, Chris, we're going to place, we're going to show you some pictures and we're going to play some songs related to them. The first two to properly connect face to the music goes on to the next game. Let's see the faces now, please. You know all those faces, Chris? Yeah. David, Donna? No. Music, please, Tommy. <laughs> David, Michael what have you got? Michael, Michael Rose Michael Bowler Shore, Leonard. looking for Michael, Michael Leonard. Leonard. Go ahead without me, David. You're me. <laughs> David, you'll be in the next game. All right, Donna, Chris, just you two are playing. Next clue, Tommy. My Donna, neighbor. what have you got? My Hi, neighbor. neighbor. 
neighbor Jim looking neighbor. for. Jim Neighbors, you go to the next game. You and David. Chris, well played. He had to say goodbye to you. Have a nice day for you next day. Donna, David, the next game is one of you will learn the right. We can get touch him and our championship game. We're going to be back and turn the first one on the beat right after this. Thank you, John Holland. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to game three of Face the Music. Down to two contestants here, tie game. You both got here through tiebreakers, so now then, we're going to find out which one goes on to play for $10,000 in cash. Each puzzle is going to be worth 30 points, contestants. Only one of you will survive this. Donna, David, <coughs> music, please. Tommy, we're looking... Oh, wait a minute, Tommy. Hold on a minute. The, this is a very interesting category that we've got going for you here now. We've never done this before, and this is only one person in this category. This is the only woman, only woman, to win all four major talent awards, the Oscar the Tony, the Emmy, and the Grammy. Would one of you like to guess before we spoil this with music? Well, that's not yes. Good. <laughs> music, please, Tommy. <laughs> David, what have you got? I got it. Spanish eyes. Spanish eyes. Looking for Rita Moreno. Rita Moreno, you are right. You've got a big lead over 30 points. And then you sing. And then you sing. First clue, Tommy. I got it. I got it. Donna, what have Mother you got? Mary smiles at me. Hey, Jude. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> David, can you give me the correct title? Not the whole song, just uh, the title. No, I can't. Uh, Let it be. Yes. Let it be. You had the right group, the wrong song. I mean, you're saying. Next clue, Tommy. I got it. What's Sleepy that? time gal. You're right. Let it be. Sleepy time gal looking for what familiar saying? Let sleeping dogs lie. You're pretty good at this. You're right. You got it. Well done. Looking for an unusual occupation? He's got kind of a big lead there, Donna. You guess fast, guess right, you might catch him. Unusual occupation? Here's Tommy and that band. David. Come to the circus or come to the big top or under the tent. Donna, the big tent. Donna would you like to take a few guesses? Oh, not after that, no. No. <laughs> nothing under the did tent. David, you, did David use up all your guesses? Uh, yeah. You say I, nothing under nothing the tent. Nothing under the tent. The greatest show on earth. Uh, the right There's idea. the title. Yeah, you did. You had the right idea. Wrong titles. All of those that you named. Oh, we? 12 of them. You named. The greatest show on earth. We're looking for an unusual occupation. occupation. Music, please, Tommy. <laughs> I got it. Whistle while you work. You guys should try that sometime. <laughs> the greatest show on earth, whistle while you work, unusual occupation. A lion tamer. Oh, I remember that whistling lion tamer. Yeah, no wonder. <laughs> no, that's not the one we're looking for. Lisa, next clue, please. I'm putting on my top hat. What do you got, David? I'm putting on my top hat, uh, uh, putting on my white tails, uh, Donna, can you give me the correct The title? only thing I can think of is top hat. You got that. Yeah. Top hat, white tie, and tails. Whistle while you work, the greatest show on earth, looking for an unusual occupation. Next clue, Tommy. I got it. Send in the clowns. The greatest show on earth, whistle while you work, Top hat, white tie, and tail. Send in the clowns. What unusual occupation? A ringmaster. You've got it. Another 30 points for you there, David. There's the bell. That means, David, you go to the championship game. John Holland, what do we have for Donna Anderson? For you, Donna, it's Hellbro's quartz watches. For him and her, fashion elegance plus incredible accuracy with integral rope design bracelets from Hellbro's. It's yours, Donna, from Face the Music. Glad you have. Sure. Just a minute, you're going to play our championship game. Win it, win it five times in a row. You're going to win something else. What do you got for him, John? We'd have the Dodson 210, most affordable Dodson of them all. Economy that will make you feel rich. Quality all around you, the all 
new 210 hatchback by Dodson. Good luck, David, from Face the Music. We'll be back with David Swanson, our champion, in our championship game right after this. Once again, let's face the music with Ron Ely. Thank you, John Howard. Welcome to our championship game and our champion, Glad Thompson, and our challenger, David Swanson. David, Glad, you both know how to play this game, don't you? Right. right. <laughs> He's just loud. Speak up, David. Don't be shy. Yes, sir. David, Glad, shake hands. Come out fighting. We are looking for a famous man. Famous man, $10,000 in cash on the line. First clue, Tommy. What have we got there? There's no business like show business. I had to look up to make sure that wasn't Howard Cosell. <laughs> no business like show business is right. You're gonna have 10 seconds to think about it. At the end of that time, come to you for your answer. Start the time now, please. David, you've heard there's no business like show business. We're looking for a famous man and $10,000 in cash is yours if you can name him. It looks like Jack Lemon. No, it's not Jack Lemon. Next clue, Tommy. <laughs> One, two, three, jump, and Sir Echo. No, it's neither one of those. It's Sir Duke. You've heard there's no business like show business, Sir Duke. Music, please, Tommy. What have you got, Glass? I got I'm an old cow hand. There's no business like show business, Sir Duke. I'm an old cow hand for $4,000 in prizes. Who is it? John Wayne. John Wayne is a rock. <laughs> Sir Duke, he's called the Duke. Oh, God, and one of the greats. We miss him a lot, too. John Wayne. John Harlan, what do we have for David Swanson? For you, David, take off American Tourist style with Cross Country, the smart-looking, lightweight, molded luggage with wheels and T-bar handles and larger cases. American Tourister makes travel an elegant, effortless experience. And take it easy with Yashica's new FX3 camera, the super compact SLR camera for perfect pictures every time. So easy to handle with its advanced technology from Yashica. Yours to enjoy, David, from Face the Music. Thank you, David. Hope you have fun. I sure do. John Harlan. Tell them Glad Tom for what she's won today. For $4,000, Glad has won the cookware, the lamps, and Burke Lines living room group, including sofa and love seat with plump button tufted to billow packs and loose pillow cushions for casual comfort, contemporary styling accented by exposed wood trim. The living room group from Burke Line and a self cleaning electric range with digital timing center and the exclusive no turn speed broiling system. Broils meat on both sides at once. Sealing in natural juices furnished by White Westinghouse and America the Elegance New Manhattan with stereo headboard and nightstand for the most contemporary minded upholstered in brown belt with brass trim. The Manhattan by American the Elegant. Congratulations, Glad, from Face the Music. Thanks for being with us today. We'll see you next time. And once more, we face the music. Tommy! Additional prizes furnished by American Tourist Group, Yashica Incorporated, the Birdline Corporation, White Wrestling House Alliance Company, and America the Elegant. This is John Harlan speaking. Face the Music starring Ron Ely's Sandy Frank production.